You'll notice that on my website, I'm using quite a lot of different colors. Now, whenever you're making websites, you cannot simply just type, I don't know, I want my background to be blue. It doesn't work like that. So what's needed to happen is everyone in the world who makes websites got together and they said, we need to come up with computer code to make a color system. And what we have is something called RGB, red, green, and blue. And every color you can ever make, let's say orange, consists of red, that amount of red, that amount of green, no blue. So it uses red, green, and blue, or red, green, or blue. So this color here, lots of red, lots of blue, but no green. Now look what happens to green when I go to green. Lots of green, a little bit of red, a little bit of blue. If I go to big time green, no red, green, no blue. If I go to red, red, no blue, so green, no blue. So it's called the RGB system, where different pixels are mixed together. So these are called pixels. Little dots you see on the screen are called pixels. All the pixels are mixed together to create colors. Now, when I'm making a website and I want to use, let's say, the color purple, I don't type in RGB 1020102. Mm -mm. So I don't simply just do this. I want my background to equal color that. No. What I do is I actually use something called hexadecimal code, which is this. You don't need to learn it. You just need to know that when you're making websites, you use hexadecimal code for your colors. So look at, if I go to pink, it changes the hexadecimal code. It also changes this. These two things, this hexadecimal and RGB are linked together. The hexadecimal is so that the computer can understand what color I want to pick. So let's say I want to do that background color there you go the computer will know now I want to use this color orange for my background I don't really now what the computer would do is then turn it into binary code so let's show you why so this is me making my website let's just put a computer laptop here. Okay. Now it just looks like I've got breasts. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. So imagine I'm on my laptop and I'm making my background orange. I'll use hexadecimal because hexadecimal is easy for me to program. I can just type it in. Computers don't really understand hexadecimal. So what they'll do is they'll turn it from hexadecimal into binary code so that the computer can say yo make the website background orange and it'll do that so let me just recap everything again we needed to create a color system called rgb which everyone agreed about all the people who make websites rgb then uses pixels of red green and blue and it mixes them up to create different colors from this, RGB creates what's called a hexadecimal code for each color. Every color has a hexadecimal code. In this case, orange. When I'm making websites, I will use the hexadecimal code to make background orange or to make the font col colors change different colors. Whenever you see color on a website, it's using hexadecimal code. Remember that. The computer will then turn that hexadecimal code into binary code because that's what it understands so it'll turn this orange hexadecimal orange and it'll turn into binary code orange 